it's Emily and welcome back or to my YouTube channel. Today's video is so exciting because I am packing today to go to PFYC. I am so excited. I'm just ready to go. Um, well, not really, I still gotta pack. Today is Friday and we are leaving on Tuesday to head down there, but I wanted to go ahead and start packing today because that'll give me Friday, Saturday, and then Monday I can just finish up and get the house clean and go to the store and grab anything else that I may need. I'm getting started early because I hate waiting till the day before and I end up staying up till like midnight and being so tired and I just like packing early. If you're confused and you don't know what PFYC is, PFYC stands for Pentecostal Fire Youth Conference and it is a conference that is two days in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee and our Pentecostal Holiness Churches get together and we have a conference for the youth. But even though it's called Youth Conference, it's for everybody, all of us come and we support our youth. It is just a great time. I always love going to PFYC. I get to see people that I don't normally get to see and it's nice to see friends and catch up. And of course, the services are always amazing. It is just so good. So I am stoked. <laughs> I am not even gonna lie to you all. I totally just staged this picture for my thumbnail because I thought it would be more aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> And it looks really cute if I do say so myself. But <laughs> I am taking all of these things to PFYC. It's just not gonna look that cute in my suitcase. <laughs> my bed is bare because I had to wash my sheets because Rosie peed on them. So that's why my bed is down to just the cover. So I thought it would be super fun to bring you all with me and we could pack together because I know you all are packing for PFYC as well. Springtime can be so tricky to pack for because you never know if it's going to be cold or hot and so you kind of got to dress and plan outfits for it to go either way. So I'm going to show you some different things that I'm packing and give you a couple ideas. So how I pack is I just like put all of my stuff that I'm packing in a pile or I'll just like throw it in my suitcase. And then once I have everything together, that's when I actually organize it in my suitcase and actually pack it all together. So I'm just gonna be like throwing stuff on my bed. You all seen that I wore this dress a couple videos ago. And I think these dresses, I actually bought this for spring because I think these dresses are perfect for spring. So I'm gonna take this dress I'm also going to pack my sandals and if it's warm I'm just going to wear this dress and these sandals and I'll have a nice spring outfit. But if it's cold I am bringing my denim jacket which I think is a spring and fall essential and if it's cold I can just throw this denim jacket over top of this dress and I'll wear some socks with my white tennis shoes and it's like still springy looking but it'll keep me warm if it is a little cool and then if it does like warm up later on in the day I can always take my jacket off so definitely bringing my tennis shoes definitely bringing this dress I'm also bringing these tennis shoes probably for like the gym I'm bringing my white denim Skirt. I don't know what I'm gonna wear with this yet, but also gonna bring my black denim skirt. This goes with a lot of different things. I wore this all through the fall and winter, but I haven't hardly wore it in a while. And I think I'm gonna pack this as well. Probably gonna pack this outfit because I think it's cute and it's like springy. This bag is gonna be my tech bag. It's gonna have my laptop my camera, all my chargers and cords is going in here. And I had some people ask me after I did my carry-on essentials video if I like this bag. Yes, I love this bag. Once I got it, I love it and I do recommend this bag. Got my tripod. My mic. Oh, I forgot to put my mic on. Oh well. 
I'm gonna try to vlog some at PFYC. I'm not gonna vlog any of the services, but I thought it would be cool if I vlogged a little bit and I thought that it would be really fun if I meet you all there at PFYC, I could include you in my vlog and that would be a lot of fun if you wanted to, of course. So I am gonna take my camera and I'm gonna take my computer and all of my stuff. Most of the stuff that's going in this bag, I'm using the next couple of days. So I'll have to finish packing that. I also wanted to show you all this super cute bag that I'm gonna be taking with me. And this bag is from Teddy Blake. This video is in collaboration with Teddy Blake. They sent me this purse to share on my YouTube channel and it is so cute. I had been wanting a brown leather bag for a while so I was super excited when they reached out to me and I found this on their website and it smells like leather and I love it. It comes with this dust bag that I can keep it nice and protected. I'm gonna put the bag in here before I pack it and it also has this little pouch thing and it's connected to the bag so I think that's super cool that that's connected and then it can go in your purse and on the inside I've got some chapstick in here it's like a orange it's really cool looking I think and springy so they sent me a coupon code for you all to use on their website so I will be linking that coupon code down below for you all so make sure you go to their website and check out their bags I love this bag I just think it's very cute and classy looking and this brown just goes with everything I also like the size because I do have two kids I feel like I can fit a lot of their stuff in here but it's not too big to where I feel like it's big and chunky I think it's like the perfect size so I'm gonna link this purse down below so you can find it and you can see their other purses as well. Thank you again to Teddy Blake. I love this. Also, I know you all are gonna ask because I've had a lot of questions on my Instagram already, but I found this at TJ Maxx. One of my friends posted, she bought one and she posted it on her Instagram and said she bought it from TJ Maxx. So I went to my TJ Maxx and they had them as well. So go check your TJ Maxx out. I've got a random red scarf in here, but these are super, what else is that? Oh, Everly's bracelet. These are super cute and summery. One of these days I'm gonna get actual traveling shoe bags, but for now I still use gallon storage bags to put my shoes in when I travel so they don't get messed up. I have a really small foot so it works for me because I wear six. But some people had commented that their shoes wouldn't fit in a Ziploc bag, but they do make Ziploc bags in two gallon bags. So you could try that, cause they're, they're like double the size of this. I don't know if they would work or not, but. So one of the other reasons that I wanted to make this video is cause I'm kind of nervous about meeting you all at PFYC because my husband was trying to explain to me that because I have a YouTube channel that people expect for me to be very like outgoing, extroverted and stuff like that. But I feel like being around big crowds and a lot of people, I don't know, kind of makes me nervous because I feel like I have, I feel like I'm socially awkward. Like whenever I talk to people, I'm like stumbling over my words and I feel really like awkward and I don't know what to say. And I was so worried that some of you all would meet me and think that I was rude or stuck up. But is anybody else like that? <laughs> like I wanna try to be nice and talk to people, but at the same time, it makes me like really nervous because I just look at a camera, like I don't see all of you all in person or I think it would be a lot different. So, anyways, if we do get to meet at PFYC, 
I hope I come off right. I'm gonna try really hard to be nice and friendly and not be so awkward, but if I have a hard time talking, I'm sorry. I'm just like really bad at being like social sometimes, I feel like. I love being social and I love talking to people and I think I feel more comfortable around people that I know, but people that I don't know, I feel a little more awkward and I have a harder time. So I definitely want to meet you all if you're gonna be at PFIC, but just know I'm a little nervous about it, okay? Like I'm the type of person that feels like I walk funny when I walk in front of people. It makes me like so nervous. So, uh, but I'm super excited at the same time, if that makes any sense. I got a few things over here. Most of my clothes are hang up clothes. I will be packing some casual outfits in my suitcase, but I've got to wash a few things, but here's all of my hang up clothes. Most of my PFYC outfits are over there, and I'm actually gonna be packing most of my stuff into this huge suitcase. So I got most of my shoes packed, I got some of my clothes packed, I still need to do laundry, get the rest of my clothes in here, like my pajamas and other socks and underwear and stuff. I don't think I have anything else in here that I can pack because I need to do laundry and I need to go through the clean clothes that I have and get stuff in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and start packing my toiletry items. I can go ahead and get my little bottles and start getting those filled. Okay, so I was planning on packing at least my toiletries before I had to leave, but I looked at my clock and realized I had to get ready and leave and get the girls ready. We had to go to ensemble practice. We just got home a little bit ago and we had to stop and get the girls from my parents house and I just put the girls to bed and it is 10:45 now so I was planning on packing more after we got home but I'm just so tired now that I finally got the girls to sleep I'm just gonna go to bed I'm just gonna get up in the morning and finish packing so I hope you liked this video if you did give it a thumbs up leave me a comment down below and let me know if you're gonna be at PFYC this year because I'm so excited and I can't wait to see everybody I hope you have a wonderful day bye